7 to 11, 22 to Kenny. 8300. Please identify your name, sir. Uh, my name is Kelly Joseph, K E L L Y. What is your occupation, Mr. Joseph? No, I'm just mostly trying to be a stand up comedian. What was your relationship like with your brother? My, my brother and I, we got actually along pretty well. We, we really did. Uh, for being twins and having other brothers and sisters, we got along good. The day he died actually started off with a weird 911 call, I guess you could say. It was uh, a strange call, but ironically, it was not really the first type of call that he had been investigating that month. He had showed up to the scene with his partner Lily, I remember, and they were going in to check out the house. Uh, pretty certain that they knew what they were going to find. Uh, and from then on, uh, things proceeded accordingly, I guess you could say. Well, that's certainly something you don't see every day. That is a giant shit. Oh, yeah, it is. We need to find out where it came from. Now, Lily was new. That's true. Uh, she was new to the division, but Ted was not. He was in forensics, and he had been there for a while, actually. Yeah. Well, it's definitely him, and it's definitely poop again. Ah. We have uh, foot patrol in the local areas. No really clear sign of entry, although the son of a bitch did break a window coming in. Yep. It's poop, all right. And the other thing you gotta know is my brother's often yep. been accused of being too hands-on with his work. Warm. Uh, yeah, it's him, all right. How you doing there, buddy? Who did this to you? Immediately walking into the room, my brother was certain that actually he was the same suspect that they had been following. Let's take a look. Oh. oh okay, there she is. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Tim, write this down in your notes. Well, it's a multi-log operation for sure. It's another signature from him, if you not noticed. This is my first day at work, I mean... Well, after the initial investigation was completed, uh, I think everybody was surprised when they got called at the scene and said that they had struck again, uh, this time in a different location. It was a convenience right, store, I believe. I'm gonna need that analysis on my desk in 48 hours, all right? 48 hours? It's gonna at least take three days. I'm gonna need 48 hours there. Why so strict? I don't know, I just need 48 hours, alright? That's like asking me to make a movie in 48 hours. It's impossible. It can be done. Sometimes it could be good, too. We gotta go. We got another call. What? We got a fresh one. From what I recall, Are actually, the poop was in an uh, O shape. It was a, a circular sort of log formation. No. I don't know. Uh, that much I remember exactly. You know, quite frankly, I'm not satisfied with the answers I'm getting here today. Help us out. We're trying to help you out. Guys, if you want to know the answer, it's right over there. I don't know how it got here. And I know for certain that the commissioner was really on him about this because there was no leads, no nothing, and it was really stressing him and Lily out. Uh, big time. They were frustrated. I know that. Very frustrated. You know, it doesn't help that he was constipated at the time due to the stress, but the la well, the last thing he said to me was that he uh, had to go talk to Ted from forensics really quick. Uh, before he could come drop off the cables to my house. When are we going to get a decent lead on this guy? Oh man, come on. Our chance I think the notion of leaving work really caused him uh, a sense of relief. I am off from my home. And that sense of relief... Uh, long day. And I think that sense of relief just there. really allowed him to sort of alleviate what was bothering him that day. Sing me some new, uh, new, uh, Truth be told, he always thought he was going to die like this. I always thought I was going to die like this.
I'm, I'm confident though that one day that they will find out who's been doing this and that uh, that person will be brought to justice, you know. I just saw him drive away about five minutes ago. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. Okay. Thank you. No problem. Well, Mr. Kelly, I think that's all for today. I want to thank you for coming in on your free time. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Uh, if you have any questions or concerns, please let us know. Will do. Well, actually, if, uh, I have a stand-up gig tonight on East 4th if you want to come out. 8 o'clock. That's quite all right. We're going to pass on that. Well, maybe think about it for a second. <laughs>